Seven steps how to wrap trees with Christmas lights. Professional Christmas lights installation. Step one, tie your extension cord off at the base so you can pull it taut as you need. Step two, always have your lights in a ball so that you can roll them up the light or up the tree and use about a four finger gap as you go up the tree. As you get bigger trees, make the gap larger. Uh, less is more, these lights really start to go off at night. Leave the lights loose as you wrap about a finger to go in there and leave the lights on because it's more fun and you can see if anything is broken as you go. Number four, put in a staple so your wraps don't slip down the tree. And take it easy with the staple. Give it a little space. Don't crush it on here hard and push it in. Shoot it with a little gap so that there is room for the tree to expand. Bonus tip, when you get to the end of a strand and you want to connect a new strand, instead of connecting these two together like this, you'll have a big foot long gap with no lights. Lay the plugs next to each other. Just tie them in a simple knot over each other. And now you have a shorter gap in between the lights. Number five and six, take each juncture as it comes. So this first juncture, the lowest one, you're gonna go out on. And then number six is I'm gonna double the space as I go out because I'm gonna have to come around. So I'm gonna get to the end. And then number seven is I want to come back in the design that I made going out. So I'm never crossing wires. And that is number seven is never cross the wires. You get them lined up so that they come back down the tree the same way they went up. And now returning with this same pattern so it's all even, I'll come back up the tree in the same four finger pattern that I was at before. And then I'm gonna take this branch off here, the first one that comes up, and I'll go up and leave space to come back down. And you'll complete the tree the same way to the top. 